Do you feel the vibe? Hi guys, welcome back to one of my um videos. Um, today what we're gonna be doing is making a servo horn for an RC plane. Um, I prefer this to be on a foam RC plane or a small. I prefer a um foam plane, but whatever you prefer. So what we're gonna need to get started is, of course, you're gonna need a servo rod. I just got this servo rod. I picked it up for three dollars, and I got like four of them. So that was pretty good. Then you're going to need like a card, nothing particular, but just a regular card that you can cut. And then as you see down here is my base, a cutting board. So I can just do anything I want on it. It's a cutting board. Um, so yeah, um, yeah, let's get started. So first what you're going to want to do is just to look at your size plane and just, um, oh, does it? I need these right here. But anyways, uh, what you're going to want to do is just size plane. So what you're going to want to do is just kind of draw what size you probably going to need. So here's mine right here. Right here. Um, right here. Then what you're going to want to do is get a razor blade. I prefer if you want to be safe. I really don't care. I use this all the time. Use scissors. Scissors actually is it cuts it way easier and faster but i just like using this it's just fun but anyways um just cut this and the cool thing about this is what you're gonna always need is scissors also what i'm just doing is making a guideline see how it's already bending off then you're just going to use the scissors to cut around and it makes it super easy now, so you already have this, you're about already close to being done, or you call this finished. But then you're gonna, gonna want to look at it. And then you're gonna notice there's a long flat side, a medium down side, and a little small side. So take a look, you see if you could tell the difference. But anyways, then what you're gonna want to do is you're gonna want the, the, the longest side that was the longest side is going up and down to be flat so you're going to want to put a hole up and oh dropping the pencil up in this area so you're going to want to put it up in this area in this corner but don't put it too close to the corner or when you cut or as bot going by the rc planes moving the servo it would start to crack and then one day hopefully not but just this which is supposed to fit in there and out, this right here is gonna break off and you're not gonna have any control of your RC plane, either ailerons or elevator or rudder. So, what you're gonna want to do is cut a hole about somewhere in the area. I'm about to cut it, I'm about to show y'all before I cut, keep cutting it, but right in there. Not about the same length from each side, but not too close, because if you get it too close, it's going to snap in one of these areas, and you don't want that. So, you're going to want to have 100% a cutting board under you, because if you do not have a cutting board, it's going to go right through your table, your kitchen table, whatever you're on, and I just, and you just don't want to mess that up. So, that's why I have a cutting board. And then when you cut it, you're going to just do a little teeny hole, and then you're going to start to come on the other side. Now, I prefer... In this method, do not cut towards you because I actually got cut in a few times right here. As you can see, just by holding it like this, it's actually sliding. Actually, with the same razor blade, so don't don't do that. And only if you have if you only have a razor blade, do what I'm doing right now, cutting away from me like this. And don't cut like this. So you're gonna want to cut the extract off of this so it won't stop the servo arm from turning then you're going to measure it and i think mine is a little too small and i have to make it a little bigger but if it's just just pl uh, play with it and get it in and then there it is um a perfect servo horn um yeah so the servo one you could one card look how it just took this corner you could cut at least like 20 of these out 
if you use it wisely, like you could put another one right here, cut another one, and they keep cutting them. So um yeah, and actually it's actually a pretty good way to start uh, to recycle these cards and stuff. So yeah, I have like <laughs> like more well, like five of these cards. I was about to say haunted, but that'd be lying. But I don't want to lie to my viewers, right? So um yeah. So what your so the next step. I ain't gonna show you this, but in my other videos I will. But you just wanna go. You're just going to want to attach this flat beside to the RC plane and hot glue it, gorilla glue it, glue it any how you want to, any way you want to. You're gonna glue it and then make sure it's very strong. Cause if it's not strong, then what you're gonna do is you're gonna push your servo back and snap. It's gonna come off. So yeah, and it's actually pretty strong, durable stuff. So yeah. It'll take a long time for this thing to break if you do it right. So yeah, um, yeah, this is what it looks like. This is what it's supposed to look like, right there. Um, there's the other side. Just showing the other side. And then, if you don't know how to put this in, you're a new RC plane version. You see the hole, and then you're gonna just slide this straight through, and then twist the rod going up, and then you're done. And you're gonna want like a zigzag, right? Like that. Like that, guys. So, yeah, and then you push up and down. Something just like that. Okay, my camera finally focused. But, anyways, just like that. And, yeah, um, that's pretty much all you need to make a good, durable servo horn. Um, so, yeah, so that's pretty much it. You need a, to make it, you should make the car, the, uh, you need the razor blade. You need the scissors, and then you're going to need the servo horn, of course. That's how you make it. So, or not servo horn, the servo wire. But anyways, um, guys, make sure to like and subscribe. And by the way, if you're down there, hit the subscribe button. Make sure to hit the notifications. I post videos every, I don't know yet. <laughs> but, um, yeah, uh, I'm going to be doing more RC playing videos. And if you did not know... Guys, I'm very in the RC plane, so I have all kinds of stuff, and uh, in the future videos, I'll be shown. So yeah, um, guys, hopefully you have a great day. Bye. Yo!